So we're here to report on our small study uh, looking for molecular disease monitoring in patients with non-Hodgkin's lymphoma uh, treated with anti-CD19 CAR T-cell therapy. Um, of the 10 patients that we evaluated, we had results on nine patients. Uh, three of those patients ended up in a complete metabolic remission, and the other six ended up having progressive disease. Um, we used an assay developed by Adaptive Biotechnologies to do this that looks at cell-free DNA and the amount of recombinations in the VDJ portion of the immunoglobulin. Um, and we found that for our patients with a complete metabolic response, there was no measurable cell-free DNA um, in any of those patients at day 14, day 28, and later. Of the six patients who had progressive disease, five of them had high levels of cell-free DNA. Um, and there was really just one patient uh, who had a progressive disease that had unmeasurable cell-free DNA.